Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Let's Go For A Drive. And today I am actually in the middle of nowhere. Okay, so uh, apparently I got really bored and uh, I took, I went for a cruise. Uh, a lot of dust everywhere. And it's uh, apparently already a uh, summer reset. And uh, nothing else is going on really. Uh, I had the day off apparently. I'm basically finished with all my semesters, and uh, apparently I'm back to where I first started. Well, actually, no, I'm, I'm like, uh, let's say, 10 miles south of Columbus, south, uh, southwest. So once I get up here, um, looks like there's a left or a right turn. I'm gonna go left. I'm gonna turn left up here. Looks like I'm on 142. It really doesn't say street on it. It just says 142. Which is pretty weird for a street. I don't know. It just says 142 for some reason. Okay, so right now we're heading west. Uh, I'm actually now going southwest of Columbus, Nebraska. And we're gonna keep going for, I, I don't know. I don't know how long this video is gonna be. so sure where this road takes you but I know for a fact that it's getting me closer to David or sorry Duncan Nebraska which is uh like 10 miles south of west of Columbus <laughs> apparently I'm coming down with something right now because I've been sneezing all day and that's uh that's not good Looks like it's uh, going to take me south. Only, uh, don't have time to really go out for a cruise to myself. The only times that where I would drive is for things that I do need, like if I needed to go home or something, if I needed to go to the bank or, or somewhere else, that's the only time where I would really be out on the road. But now, basically have a month before I go back up to the college, and that's pretty nice. So I need to find another road and hopefully, hopefully 
pray to God that it'll take me back west. So at the beginning where it was, it, there was actually another road and I think I know why I didn't go on there because last time I was on it, uh, it's been like a year ago, it was completely flooded for some reason. I had fun skidding, skidding across the mud and uh, let me tell you a story about that. So one time I was out driving blah 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 uh, over by Shell Creek, well uh, east of Shell Creek. There was this road and uh, apparently had a low maintenance sign on it, which I clearly didn't see, and then, uh, basically the road was complete dirt and mud, and, uh, apparently I lost control twice, and, uh, somehow landed up in a cornfield, managed to get out of the cornfield, and then just kept going straight, having the guts to accomplish to what I needed to accomplish, and, uh, apparently I, I don't know what else happened, I just kept going, thought to myself I knew I could do it until there was this giant hill up ahead. I was like, oh crap, I'm not going to make it. Oh, let me tell you, it was all so muddy and it kind of looked like quicksand. Oh, by the way, I was sinking during the time. And uh, So, be aware of low maintenance roads unless you want to end up in a pickle. And uh, I, don't, I didn't think I had my cell phone on at the time, so uh, remember to bring your cell phone along every time you go out cruising and uh, I'm trying to find myself. Oh, I'm recording here right now. Okay. Oh, hey. Uh, over to the right uh, is the Platte River. And I was wondering if we could... This way, actually. All right. All right. So now we're continuing west. that the Platte River is right next to us.
once again, it's going to take me left again. south again apparently or oh my gosh ah! oh oh my god there was a there was a dog who just jumped in front of me oh man jesus <laughs> oh man that came out of nowhere well okay well first of all i'm all right second of all that was pretty dangerous of him Yeah, he just came out of I was about ready to ram him over. He just came out of nowhere. <laughs> Man. Okay, well, uh, I do apologize about that. Uh, about that thing. I was just frightening for my life because I don't want to hurt anybody or, or nobody. Yeah, don't want to hurt anybody at all. <laughs> okay. Uh going uh west again man only oh i don't know what type of dog that was it was like it, it was a big dog by the way i probably got that i probably got that on video <laughs> well at least <laughs> at least it wasn't a deer right because that would have been a lot more worse than hitting a dog or a deer. A deer would have been a lot worse. It just came out of nowhere. I don't know who. But yeah, that thing scared the crap out of me. <laughs> Looks like we're going, uh, oh, hey, it's Supply River. Nice. Yeah, look at that. All right. So we've got the Platte River in, uh, in front of us. Oh, man, it looks gorgeous from here. But yeah, I'll, I'll, just some, I'll show it for you for a few seconds, and then we'll be, we will be going. I kind of, kind of want to relieve myself from almost the, uh, you know. But yeah, it looks pretty nice from here. Alright, uh, we're gonna continue south. That was nice. And, uh, <laughs> it kinda made me, it made me feel a little bit better after the whole dog situation. <laughs> Yep, looks like we're going south again.
Alright, well there's uh, nothing too crazy yet, and that's a good thing. I'm trying to trying to find a way to go west again and probably not gonna happen. Unless I'm lucky enough where I can uh, turn turn right. Oh, he is, uh, he is running. He is running. Oh, gosh. <laughs> oh, he's still running. Why is everything chasing me tonight? <laughs> okay, well, um, we're probably gonna, uh, end the video soon. That cow better have not been out of its fence. Oh my gosh, that, that would be sc Oh yeah, that would be scary. <laughs> oh yeah, so far I can't go right for some reason. Now I can go right. All right, and it's going to take me west. Good deal. Well, at least there isn't any deer, not to trying to kill me out here. That's a good thing. Good deal. Okay, so right now we're continuing west, and I totally don't know what street we just turned on because of the whole cow trying to chase me, and uh, there's a dog who jumped down in front of me tonight. I just don't know what's going on in the air. I mean, it's pro probably getting dark. I've got a deer sign, so may as well watch myself for deer. Not knowing what's out here, uh, yeah, let me tell you, I have no clue what the heck is out here. So, I better be careful and try not to hit anything. Uh, so far, I haven't hit anything yet, so that's a good thing.
we're on Street J. Okay then. And uh, let's go right. And uh, oh, it's an it's actually a highway. Awesome. All right. And if I'm correct, the street's gonna take me to David City. Not David City, uh, Duncan. And then the, that's probably where I'm gonna end the video today before I hit another deer or a dog or something. I'll probably just stop at one of the gas stations to end the video. I am way past Duncan. Uh, apparently, I, I am now in Silver Creek, which is another 10 miles south of Duncan. Well, this is going to be fun. Uh, so, um, I'm going to pull over to a gas station, end the video, and then head straight for a home, which is in Columbus, Nebraska. If I continue straight, it's just gonna take me to Genoa, which I'm not gonna do that. Gotta wait for a car to come. Alright, we're good. We're now heading east into Silver Creek, Nebraska. guys well uh, thank you for checking the video i uh, appreciate it so much uh if you go ahead leave a like comment subscribe i promise i won't kill any animals tonight or any other time but if that does happen i apologize but anyways if you want to go ahead leave a like comment subscribe that'd be great anyways guys hope you have a good night